Hi War Painters! Um, today I'm going to go through something that I really, really, really like. I'm really excited about these. I picked up at Walgreens. I needed a lipstick so I was out and I felt like I looked really like sad one day. And I picked up this $2 Modern Matte from Jordana lipstick in um, the color Classy. Because Classy. it made me feel better about myself that day. <laughs> I think I had to shower and I think I'd been like at the park and I hadn't showered. It was rough. Marketing um, at work. Marketing at work. These are... Um, they're awesome. They smell just like MAC lipstick. Heather, you don't like it? it I've actually never smelled MAC lipstick. Yeah, they. it has like a slightly plasticky scent, like a lipstick. You know, most lipsticks do. This one doesn't smell like this. Though. This one smells like straight sugar. Yeah, some of them smell a little this bit. This one smells delicious. There's like more scent to them. Um, but they smell like vanilla. Um, and the scent is actually really, really reminiscent of the MAC lipsticks. Um, the matte texture on them, they look completely matte, flat matte, they last forever. Like, I actually wore this, this purpley, it's like a purpley mauve color. I, um, I have Birchbox swatch. Um, it's like a really great mauve. I wore this, the first day I got it, I didn't exfoliate, I wasn't wearing lip balm, I just threw it on, and I wore it for nine hours, and it looked hot. It looked really good the entire time, I was really excited about it. Um, so that's, and it's a good color on my skin tone. I kind of left out because I didn't like know anything about them. Um, so basically they're the most comfortable matte I've ever tried. They're super long lasting. They're comparable in texture and scent to a MAC lipstick, which is huge for me. And I actually, it outperforms my MAC, I have a retro matte, um, in Dangerous. And it's like a gorgeous orange. I love it, but the texture freaking sucks. Um, these outperform so much and if I use my MAC prep and prime underneath my lip prep and prime I can get like eight or nine hours out of these and they still look awesome with like almost no touch-ups. They sell primers for lips now? Yes it's <laughs> so if you haven't tried MAC prep and prime, prime I should do a video. Everything. Everything. It um it goes on underneath like a lip balm it's white it goes on clear <sighs> but it has a slight gluey smell to it and it literally is like lipstick glue it doesn't smell bad it's it's very very light odor but once it's on it's also had some of the vanilla scent like most mac lipsticks you're just gonna puke <laughs> <laughs> um but once it, you put that on i let it sit for a minute and then i put a lipstick on top and something like like a cream it'll add a creme whatever or a satin it'll add like an hour creme. or two um and i can usually get through one meal and like a cup of coffee with a matte, it'll last like two or three hours, and I can probably wear a matte all day with like minimal touch-up. Let's put these to the test because, as you may know, I do not wear many lip she products. She hates lip products. I hate things on my lips. I constantly bite my lips. Okay. They get everywhere. They get on my teeth. I smudge them everywhere. I despise things. I sorted them by scent. So any of these three are okay. These smell disgusting. I'm going to put matte pretty, the pretty on you. Um, okay. But first, let me do the swatches. So this is classy. It's a mauve kind of purpley pink. Um, this one is blush. Oh, by the way, there are like 16 or 18 available on their website. There are only nine at my Walgreens. You can get them at Walgreens or Kmart or the Georgiana website. You're doing really well. Do you, mean, doing, do you want me to help you? Yeah, I do. That's right. No. Um, okay, so. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. What happened? Oh, God. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. I'm a monster. Okay, so I'm going to do Heather's lipstick for her on camera. Wow. <laughs> okay, so this is a prime example of really bad packaging on lipstick. Um, These have like a flat tip. Let me fix your face. No, stop. Don't touch it. All right, come here. <laughs> so this is pretty. Pretty is a little too pink for me most of the time. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I teared up and I'm wearing a physician's formula. Should oh. not our brew. I am not a makeup artist. I do makeup on myself. I have there we go. little lips. You do have very little lips. They're adorable. Ducky lips. Ducky lips. That's our mom. <laughs> <laughs> no, ducky lips are cute. They're adorable. You have adorable lips. And Heather should have exfoliated. Um, because they are a matte. The color is really good on you, actually. I'm just really not going to put lipstick on other people. Because they are matte, um, 
you really should exfoliate. You should probably put a balm underneath to make them last longer and go on a lot smoother. No. Are <laughs> you going to do warp? <laughs> so Heather is getting a little crazy. Are you sure you're not drunk? <laughs> I don't so really Heather is day. watching Caliente, which is the shade I'm wearing. It's my uh, my favorite. I like my blush. Orange. <laughs> going to blend that shit out. <laughs> no, this is a new look, guys. Okay. Sorry, I really derailed this video. <laughs> I'm really enjoying this. We're really like, we'll swatch uh, pretty next to classy. This is, this is what's on the lips, so you can focus on It's time. more of a peachy. <laughs> it's more of a peachy pink. Um, I see what's on my face. Nice, okay. It's a good color for okay. Heather. It's actually really not a great color on me, but that's fine. So cool um, skin tones. It's a yes. Yeah, Um. this one I actually love. This one is blush. It goes on, it's like a perfect nude for me. Um... These are not as pigmented. I usually do like three or four coats and then I blot it down. So you can see that one. It's like a really dusty rose with a slightly kind of purple tone to it. Um, we'll do better swatches on our website too. Go to warpinkbeautyblog.com and we will do swatches that are better than these. Um, so that's blush. <laughs> Frappuccino is like the classic 90s brown lipstick. I put it on and went, oh, this looks like high school. Um... I put it on and immediately wanted to take it off. Some people are really into browns right now. If you're into browns, it's a great like warm brown. It's like milk chocolate color basically on my lips. Well, tart whole cocoa lime, chocolate thin. It doesn't smell like chocolate. It does not. It smells that like one smells like chemicals. That one's disgusting. You are so funny. I guess if they all smell pretty much the same to me. Well, okay. Two of these smell if like If you the want chocolate. brown, uh, Frappuccino is a really good brown. Um, and then we get to the reds. I'm wearing Caliente. It's more of an orangey red. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you're drunk, but you're not. <laughs> um, that one's really pigmented, and it goes on really well. I really, really like this one. I've been carrying that in my purse, like, every day. And then we get to Style. Yes. This is number 12, Style. If you like blue-toned reds, it's a great blue-toned red. Yeah. So cool skin tones, you know. It's, it's, it goes on, like, oh, it's gorgeous. Oh, that's the one I should have wore painted with. Where is it? Where is it? Right there. I mean, a war paint. Yeah, breed. war paint. So you can see how blue toned it is compared to the more orange Caliente. <laughs> I feel like I look fabulous right now. You kind of do. I mean, it, can this be the new blush look? We're going to make it the new blush look. <laughs> you hot. saw it here first, guys. Um, so there's the range of what I bought. Um, like I said, this is only 6 out of 16 or 18 on their website. They have some really great purples. They have one that looks similar to... Um, Aria from Stila in the the liquid lipstick. These last a really long time. They're not totally kiss proof. Um, you get oh. a little bit of transfer. <laughs> oh my god, the weirdest things have upset you. <laughs> I hate the, things on my mouth so much. There is a slight transfer. That doesn't taste good. You might know why. <laughs> did I get it everywhere? No, it was fine. It okay. actually looks even better than it did. I do usually blot these down. Um, but. <laughs> Alright, so fourth kiss, you get less. As I think I'll find you get almost no transfer. I can drink coffee without damaging my Oh, there we go. <laughs> There's nothing. So you just have to blot five times. And your lips still look amazing. Um, <laughs> so these are $2 to $2.50. Kmart, Walgreens, or Jordana.com is the only place I've found them. The smell doesn't linger. The smell. <laughs> I'm you are smelling my legs right now. <laughs> it is much more comfortable. I almost feel like I'm not wearing anything, but I just have super dry lips and need chapstick. Which um, is how matte lipstick feels. So I yeah. find that they're not as drying as MAC or a, like most like matte lips I've tried. The Maybelline Color Sensational Mattes are more dry. Um, these, if I blot them down, I completely forget that I wore them. Especially if I put a matte balm underneath. I will wear it all day and I'll completely forget. If you're looking for matte lipsticks, if you like matte, Jordana... Modern mats, they're awesome. The only thing is the packaging sucks. I hate the packaging. Why do you hate the packaging? Okay, the lids it's will so like the thirteen lid, year old makeup. It is. The lids can pop off in your purse. It's like a clear plastic gap. Um, they just click up like this and they do click up fine. They're pretty smooth. That's about how much product it's like a That's, normal but I hate the slant tip like this. It's the same thing with the wet and wild like mega last. You saw how well 
it, it applies really messy if you're not careful and you cannot do this without a mirror for the cost i'd rather buy this and like sub like subject myself to crappy packaging than buy a 16 dollar mac lipstick that doesn't freaking work for me totally worth the 250 if you can get your hands on these i totally recommend them um, but if you have any other matte lipsticks that you want me to try, if there's anything else that you would suggest, please let us know. Leave a comment below. Um, but for winners, Jordana Modern Mats are up there on my list. They're a big go-to. So try them out. Let us know what you think. And uh, we'll see you next time. I can see the red on my cheeks. All right, guys. Thank you. Um, subscribe so we can make more of these videos for you. And I can paint other weird stuff on my face. We should do that for the end of every video. <laughs> Honestly. <laughs> um, all right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.